welcome back to my channel Natalie Ray here welcome to today's video and honestly let's skip the intro let's just jump right into this at the house tour which is what we're all here for this is AMR housing in Honolulu Oahu Hawaii This will be a talk through video just to save us a two minute long intro but still get in all the information so this is a two-story three bedroom three baths home in the island palm communities here in honolulu oahu hawaii first room coming in is the living room there is a living room and a living space according to the floor planned also whatever furniture you guys see out here it is government furniture which is loaner furniture that we do have to give back as soon as our hhg gets here so that's right here loaner furniture side table loaner furniture and then throughout the house you guys are going to see a few other pieces that are also part of it first a little coat closet to the left phoenix just has his shoes right there we get a lot of lighting in here. There is a lot of windows, which I love. I love the flooring. I like how it's so spacious in here. Pretty big, as you guys can see. And also, look at this fan. Look at that. That's just no, not an average fan. To your right, you have these stairs, and then straight ahead, you find the kitchen to your right, the living space, and then the dining table. I don't think I'm a huge fan of this like random wall right here. I do like how it's open. If it wasn't for that, I think I would hate it. But honestly, if I can take it out, I definitely would. I just feel like it gets in the way. Still, this is such a lovely home. Coffee table was over there. I brought it over here so now I can play and just have a little play area. Again, look at all these windows also no idea where we're gonna put the tv it would be nice to have maybe a monitor right here like a projector screen i think that would be cool okay moving on kitchen honestly i'm kind of shook we got a pretty big decent sized kitchen we have an island that it's definitely not small it's pretty big we have a brand new fridge it did come with the home but you can see it is literally brand new which i love because our fridge in germany just sucked also look at all this storage look at this look at this i am obsessed obsessed so much storage i'm also glad that it came with a microwave and when we went to germany we bought one and it was like the european outlet so of course we had to leave it um and i was already thinking oh we're gonna have to buy a microwave so no we don't but more storage a lot more we also ran to the grocery store to pick up some stuff because i think it's time we start cooking at home <laughs> uh also cute little coffee area i was thinking of either making it into a coffee area a bar but then i decided to go with fruits i'm gonna push naya into eating more fruits and veggies and all that so this is gonna be the spot to kind of like display fruits that way we are tempted to grab it as opposed to having the fruits put away the bread put away i just think it's a lot tempting when you see it out also rundown these are loner kitchen supplies a toaster a coffee machine and we also got some dishes plates what else oh this one has the cups the mugs and then down here we have pots that are all loners i think one of these has the oh this one right here this one has all the cooking utensils and then forks and knives all loners again super thankful for so then moving on to this other side of the house straight ahead we have the downstairs restroom which is one of three it's pretty loud i hate that you can't turn the air ventilation off but overall it's a cute little bathroom and then with the gopro honestly it makes it look even smaller but it's a pretty good decent size to the right we have the 
laundry room that honestly I think brings in the most light. I love it. We don't own a washer and dryer and it didn't come with those two. In Germany, we did have them. Um, so we are gonna have to buy new ones, but look at this lighting in here. Also love that we have this huge sink. I just gave Naya a bath yesterday and it worked amazing. And then in here, it's just another small little closet. I already have our detergent up there and then the broom. I just have my brand just sitting out here. But look at this gorgeous view. Oh, just kidding. We're gonna get to that later. The number one thing that I should have mentioned is that my husband is stationed in Fort Schachter, which that makes all the difference in the world because he is maybe only seven minutes away from work. So we love that. Overall, this is a pretty huge room. Like, honestly, I can make a room out of this. Anyways. Moving on to the other side, we have the garage. It is a single one car garage, which I think it's important for me to say because it's pretty tight. We have a bunch of trash from things that we've been buying, like the gate, diapers, um, Phoenix's fuel, trash bins. Um, but overall, love that we have a garage with a huge storage area. Like, look at those freaking shelves. Love it. Okay. Let's go. Rest of the home. Bathroom, laundry room, kitchen. I think we covered it all. You know what? Let's go. Let's go outside. Let me show you guys this backyard. I think this was the thing that sold me. I fell in love with it. And it is a pretty big Hawaiian backyard. It's a bomb size. Look at this. It's all green. I love the privacy that we have out here. Our neighbors are pretty close. Honestly, it looks like their backyard is a little bit smaller than ours. And then it looks like their backyard is probably the same size as ours. But love, love this. I love that we have this little hill so you really can't see much. And it's just all green. Oh, obsessed. Can't wait to bring in some outdoor furniture, some outdoor lights to hang up here. And... Boom, have ourselves a barbecue night. Okay. Look at this. I love this. I love this view. I'm obsessed with it. I love how there's all these windows. Almost forgot, almost missed this huge closet, but this is probably the biggest closet I've seen. Oh, this is where the dishes, the loner dishes and all that stuff came in. So we do have it put away because we're gonna have to take everything back. We just have some random stuff. Obviously we don't have our HHG yet. Um, so the first night that we got here, we just loaded everything in here. And then little by little, I've been taking it upstairs. So it's just a bunch of random stuff. Okay, I think it's time we go upstairs. This is a gate that we just got from Target and it didn't fit. So we have tomato can and some tuna just chilling on the sides. Not the best setup, but it's keeping our one-year-old from climbing up these stairs. Also, she is sleeping right now. So my voice is going to change a little bit. Cute window. Look at this. How freaking gorgeous is this? Okay, so as soon as you come upstairs, if you go to the right, this is where you're going to have all of the bedrooms and restrooms. First room to the left is going to be the guest bedroom. It's a pretty decent size. Phoenix has all of his clothes over here, so don't mind that. But again, look at this view. All green. So gorgeous. And then the closet is a bit small. I really don't like these doors. I just think they get in the way a lot, but cute, cute guest bedroom. And then the one to the left is exactly like this one. I think it's like identical, same size and everything. So this one's gonna be a baby and girls. Um, so there's really no need for me to show you because she is sleeping in there. And then this is guest bathroom number two. Again, pretty loud. We have been showering in this one. So we have this like shower bag <laughs> just hanging up there because the water is currently contaminated here in AMR housing. So yeah, that's fun. 
pretty large mirror. Love it. I can't wait to decorate this room. To the left of that, we have a linen closet, which I love. This is going to be perfect to have just extra towels and all of that good stuff. And then this is the master bedroom, which, hello again, government furniture. We did have to run to Target to get some sheets, some pillows, and pillow shams. And then this is one of the little side tables that were downstairs that we brought up here. So I just have some random stuff in there. I think this is one of the hottest rooms in the house. I want to say our master bedroom in Germany was bigger than this one. Even though it's a good, decent size, one thing I don't like is the closet. <laughs> I think it's so small. And I'm not even going to show you the bottom of this closet because I have all of my clothes just thrown in there and it does not look cute. One of the last things is our restroom. I've actually been showering in this one in buckets. Again, water is contaminated, so we're not using anything from the sinks. We can't use it to cook, to do any of our personal hygiene. Um, we do have to go and get water around the corner, and yes, it is free, so we just have one here, one in the kitchen, and then one in the shower. But a his and hers, or his and his sink, cute overall, cute. Can't wait to decorate this entire house, honestly. And that is honestly about it. What do we think? It's gorgeous, ain't it? I do gotta say, I do not enjoy walking up and down those stairs. It's in a good area, a pretty good community. We have this gorgeous pink tree up here that I just love. How do you not want to look at that all day? Ending today's video right here. Don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not subscribed to join the Raya Shields family. And I will see you guys soon.